Hi. Now I'm going to show you how to fix a water pressure switch. So this is called a press pressure switch of a washing machine. Uh, my washing machine was overflowed and water spilled out. So uh, after uh, a little research, maybe not so little, uh, I found out that the problem is the water switch. So I took it apart and I'll show you what's inside. Well, I played a little with the with the screws here and uh, managed to short circuit it and couldn't uh, understand uh, what is wrong so I thought maybe I would uh, uh, buy a new pressure switch but uh, before, before that I decided to try and see what is going inside from the other side of this uh, switch so uh, the, it was in, uh, inside this uh, uh, black plastic. I, uh, I took uh, a tester screwdriver and pried it out. And uh, this is the the entrance of the air where you uh, where the pressure of the air uh, rises, and then uh, it uh, changes the state of the switch. So. So I could open open it up, but uh, I don't suggest you to do that. And after you see this video, you can uh, play with the screwdrivers first and see if uh, if the pressure switch uh, works fine. Because you see, it's not so easy to open it up. I broke it a little here. I hope it won't. Uh, it won't change, uh, it won't uh, make the air leak out from the vacuum. Also inside there is a diaphragm which, uh, which uh, change, uh, presses the switch here and causes it to change its, its state. Well, the main, I, I, I figured it out that my problem was I played with the with this screw and open it up and then it causes uh, a short circuit. Now why is that? I found out that this screw pushes this metal here uh, and prevent it from touching the middle metal. So it has to be inside, very, very far inside, to make it, uh, to make, to make the switch uh, in uh, not in short circuit, open circuit. So I, I uh, turn it uh, clockwise to make it uh, go far away. And now, and now it won't short circuit. I'm passing this video and uh, we'll continue. You know what? Maybe I'll uh, keep on uh, filming. So after I change this, now the middle, the middle screw, the middle screw controls. I think it controls the pressure of the spring here. So if you tighten it up, it will cause the the metal to to retract faster. If you open it up, then the spring will not tighten and it will uh, change state uh, sl slowly. There is also another screw here. This screw and 
and th there is also the screw here which has uh, this uh, plastic it's a little hard to make it inside Well, I'm stopping the video. I will continue when I see more interesting stuff to share with you. Okay, I put uh, the parts back and now I'm going to show you how to test and uh, to test uh, the switch. And luckily the, the air doesn't leak from the damage, the plastic, black plastic that uh, happened uh, by prying the switch. So uh, now I'm going to show you how to test it. I have here a multimeter. I put it on the uh, continuity check. It beeps uh, where there is a continuity. And I'm going to check this contact and this contact in the middle and then another check with the middle contact and the left contact. Now one of them should, uh, should be short circuit and the other not and when I blow air here uh, it inverts the condition of both, both of them. So the first one that was a short secret will be an open secret and the other one would be short secret. So if I you see the sound it's short secret. I connect to the other, no sound. Now I simply blow here. Like that. Also, you can hear the click when I blow. It means that the diagram uh, pushes the the contact, and the spring uh, put it back when I stop blowing. So it seems uh, it seems to work fine. Now the original purpose of of mine was to. Uh, change the water level to make it lower because uh, the washing machine was overflowed so I think I need to only change the middle screw and open it like counterclockwise and then I think that the water the, the water level would be lower I don't think I want to touch the other screws here. This and this. This, like I said before, should be quiet inside to stop uh, short circuiting the wall uh, switch. This one, I'm not quite sure the purpose of it. It seems like it uh, it makes the contact faster, but I found out that the middle one should be the important one. Okay, so uh, the final check would be to put it back to the washing machine and test the water level. That should be interesting. Thank you and bye.